Alright, welcome back to the channel and welcome to Firebox Breaks. If you are new to the channel, definitely click on that bell. Press the notifications to find out when I drop these videos and also like and subscribe. Well, we have a very awesome, awesome video for you today and it is... A mail day of sorts. Well, that there is a package that has come to us by way of the United States. And moving that off to the side because there are some... There's a bit of information for the address. But it is from our good friend, Julie Farnham. Here we are. I found another one. I had to tape the box because it was coming apart. Nothing fell out. Well, that is pretty cool. That is the Target mystery box right there. That's pretty cool. We will break into that at some point. And here we go. We've got a Blaster Box Series 1. That is 22 or 23, 24. We have more content. We've got Sort of one of those air pockets that were in transit, but it's sort of deflated. Probably the high pressurized cabin pressure from the airplane, but that is it. It is now completely unveiled. And we have a letter here. That is pretty cool. The land kraken in the front there. Awesome stuff. So here we are with the note. And it was mailed on November 20th, 2023. Fire, congrats on being a winner in the Thanksgiving giveaway. Here are some extras. Keep pulling the fire and melting the snow. Your friends, Julie and the Land Krakens. Right there. So pretty cool. A lot of shadow there from the lighting above. So now you will read that if you're going to check it out. But we are on a... Massive tear, yes. So thank you, Land Krakens, of course. Julie, JD, and our good friend Dusty, who is now floating around up there being a guardian cat, so that's good. Dusty, maybe Dusty will bring the good luck charm because we are going to open up this blaster box. Why not? But we will save this one for later. That is the Target Special. That will be a standalone issue, standalone video, and that is the way it's going to go. All right, so I'm not sure what we're going to see here, but Julie normally sends the fire as well. We have a collaboration. That's pretty cool. I do not have that. Connor McDavid and Leon Dreisaitl. Actually, there's more in there in the back. Teacher's Pet, Connor McDavid, the... McJesus right there. I almost said the great one, but we already know who is the great one in the land of the Oilers. Oh, okay. So there we are. We've got two. We've got two penny sleeves containing multiple cards. Here we are. We start off with a Connor McDavid and Dry Saddle collaborations. A pageantry. That's pretty cool. Dylan Holloway, who is currently injured at this point in time. We have a Connor McDavid special edition. Did not have that one. And a Ryan Nugent Hopkins Dazzlers, the blue, the nugget. Pretty cool. Awesome stuff. And what do we have here in this penny sleeve? We have the report card of Connor McDavid. We have Leon Dreisaitl right there, Star Zone. That's pretty cool. So, Dusty, that one is for you. And Vincent DeHarnay. So pretty solid cards right there. And I'm going to put these back to back. Put them back in the penny sleeve and off to the side right there. So wow. Julie, thank you for that one. I did not have those cards whatsoever. So we will put them as mentioned. We'll put these back to back. That is pretty solid. Awesome cards. And what else do we have in store? We've got a few more team bags over there or some top-loaded cards. We've got Marcus Niemelainen. Now, Niemelainen, I believe, is back in the KHL. I believe, if not in the farm team, and he definitely plays a very solid game. So, Bakersfield Condors. Connor McDavid there 
is that the that's the FLIR. Oh, there's another one there. So Connor McDavid, that is pretty solid. FLIR Ultra, the insert card, I believe. There we are. That's the medallions from Skybox or FLIR. I do not have that, so that is awesome. Good stuff there, Julie. I'm going to put that card off to the side. That may be in the background here. Momentarily, ovation. Ryan Nugent Hopkins there. Leon Drysaddle. There we are. Wow. That is pretty solid. What else do we have? We have a pizzazz, I believe. Mike Smith. That is hard to read off to the side, but I believe it is pizzazz. Some of these cards have shifted in transit, but nonetheless, they are safe. Pretty cool. Mike Smith. Currently on the LTIR. Not sure if he'll actually make a return. And perhaps we could fix our goaltending woes as we go along. Here we are. We've got your next Dylan Holloway, Leon Dreisaitl. Pretty hard to compare those two players. Completely different game. But hey, if Dylan Holloway can actually turn out to be similar to Leon Dreisaitl, then that's a, a win there. And a hailstorm. Connor McDavid Parkhurst. Do not have that one, so now I do. And uh, that is also another pretty solid card. What do we have here? We've got a banner. Banner year of Connor McDavid. Boom. That is amazing. Wow. Banner year, Connor McDavid. There we are. Congratulations. Read that. Press pause. You know what I'm going to say. All right, for the avid viewers, what do we have here? We have another relic card, and this one is Yari Curry, Hall of Fame legend sweaters. Pretty sweet. Wow, that is uh, quite the whistle there. Oilers right wing, SP game used. Pretty solid there. Gray. And what does the write up say? So I'm going to hold that very quickly or, or steadily. And read that really quickly is what I meant to say. And what do we have here? An autograph. That is the Ryan McLeod numbered card that Julie said she was going to mail eventually. And it's numbered 79 of 99. And it's Dylan or Ryan McLeod. Ryan McLeod has sort of been dealing with a scoring slump, but hopefully he'll pick up in that regard. But nonetheless, that's a beauty of... A patch plus an autograph there. Wow. <clears throat> that deserves a stamp. So thank you, Julie, for that. That is amazing. And I'm not sure if I will get into that blaster box as mentioned. I think I'm going to do something else. I'm going to put these off to the side, though. And we'll put one of these. The banner, of course. Why don't we put the Yari Curry? We've got a lot of McDavid content on the on the side in the backdrop there as well. So I'll put the Yari Curry right there, move the Ryan McLeod just over a bit. And we are going to break open some packs of Tim Hortons. Why not? I've got a few off to the side. Why don't we pull one? Why don't we grab another one here? There's two, 23, 24. Tim Hortons cards. There's another pack right there. We will add four and we'll go with one more. So can we pull the fire here with the 23-2024 Tim Hortons, your most recent release. But already we've pulled fire with that shipment from Julie Farnham. The Ryan McLeod autograph there. Also the Yari Curry, Ryan Nugent Hopkins, Oilers content coming up all over the place. Pasta Man right there. And the middle card, boo. We got a Elias Lindholm. So the Flames kind of trying to spoil the party there. But here we are, two packs in. Already got a new Oilers content there. I do have a few cards to complete the set. So if we can hit some fire. Maybe some Minnesota North or Minnesota Wild Cards, North Stars. Wow. JT Miller. We've got Carter Hart. And the middle is Jonathan Taves. So currently unsigned at this point in time. Probably done with the career. Long COVID. 
all those sy symptoms basically adding some frustration and making it difficult to return here we are Kyle Connor we have Josh Morrissey so the Jets also trying to make an appearance here spoil the oiler party Clayton Keller right there hockey triumphs so so far three packs to go or three packs in two packs to go can we hit some major fire maybe a redemption card I have no idea but if we pulled one of those that would be awesome and we would definitely get that at some point and I think we've got a nice card there so Matt Duchesne we have a Steven Stamkos and Kale McCarr so definitely a good player superstar showcase Kale McCarr that's the back there in case you were wondering Tim Hortons all right so one more pack to go and we will end off this break the unboxing from our good friend Julie Farnham in the US and of course that was by way of a contest win we've got Dylan Cousins we have a Cole Perfetti and we're ending off on the flames of the shames the other team in Alberta Tyler Toffoli nothing exciting there we did not pull any fire with the Tim Hortons but nonetheless we did do very well when it comes to the unboxing and the shipment from Julie Farnham so we're gonna definitely remind you again I'll open up that blaster box again at some point in time or on its own and also we'll get to this box there from Target and it's only available in the United States so that's going to be a separate episode so once again Julie thank you for the cards I will definitely get some cards going your way I do have a few to add to that pending shipment but you've definitely outdone yourself as you always do and I know I am very much appreciative for your good friendship and what you do in the card community so definitely go over there and click subscribe if you're not subscribed to Julie Farnham definitely do that and let them know that firebox breaks it sent you there so we're gonna leave it there thank you again and hopefully you'll enjoy your holidays here for the remainder of the year so we'll leave it there so like comment and subscribe for all that good stuff and as always I'll be back with more content in the near future till then bye for now